Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name's Kate. If you're new here, I hope you stop a while. And if you're returning, it's lovely to see you again. Today I'm going to be showing you what's inside my empties for February. I forgot what month we were on there. So first off, we've got a calming white face mask. Um, this is one I got out of my face masks uh, I used to get. This is worth four pounds. It's a nice face mask. Um, all the Korean ones that I've tried so far are quite nice. It's quite moisturising that one. Um, next one I have is the Origins um, Jingxing Eye Cream. It's all done. This is a sample pot, it's 5 mils. Um probably took me a couple of months to finish up using it. Um, mostly in the mornings, because I was using that oil at night time. But in the last few days it was just this I was using day and night. Yep, do like it, would purchase it. Um, this is worth 7 67 as a sample size um, for the 5 mils. Next thing I got was the Whisks Wish Exfoliating Foot Mask. It says smooths and softens intense hydration. This is 74 mils. I got this in my Fab Fit Fun. I used it in my project pan. I can say that I didn't really enjoy it. I used it because it was there to use up. Um went on kind of sticky. Not the base feeling you're supposed to put socks on, then go to bed and then wash it off in the morning. It did do what it was supposed to do, just putting it on initially was sticky, so if it was for anywhere else in the body I would not have used it, but because it was for my feet I put on socks afterwards, yeah, used it up. Um, this one is classed as $32. Which is twenty four eighty in our money, and there's no way I'd be paying twenty five twenty five pound for it. It's just no way. Um, let's see what else I've got in here. The next is the Contex Oil Free Daily Moisturizer. Um, this is one of the ones I got in latest in beauty I think. It's a 20ml bottle and this is worth 5 43 I did use it on my face a couple of times. I felt it was too heavy for my face. My face felt quite greasy. Um, I was using it at night time so I didn't really like it so I finished it off with my feet. The next thing I have is the Nasif MD Detox Pad Complexion Perfection Pads, and this is 60 a pot. I got this in Fab Fit Fun as well. Um, these were worth $45, which was $34.90 in our money. Quite enjoyed these. I didn't use them. Every day I use them um, probably ever, every three to four days um, at night time. Did quite enjoy them. Probably going to keep the tub just to put my reusable cotton pads in just so I've got somewhere to sit in my room. But yeah, I wouldn't go back out and buy it, but I would use it. Uh, the next one is the Charlotte Tilbury Bronze and Glow Mask. This was one that you put on at night time. Um, 1.5 mils and this is worth £1.14. Um, can't say I noticed a massive difference in my skin the next day, but I was glowing. It did glow, that's for sure. The next thing is the Nook's Soothing Mask. 
and this is in my project pan too. This is a 50 mils and it's worth £19. Um, I did quite enjoy this. If I felt there was dry patches or that on my face, I put this on and it's basically you put it on quite um, like a decent layer, not too thick but a decent layer and you leave it on and you can either wipe in the excess or wipe it off, the choice is yours because apparently your skin will have soaked in what it needs. So, nice mask, I did get it in a beauty box, can't tell you how long ago or what beauty box but I know it was a beauty box. Um, Held it somewhere. I'll empty out the little bags then it's easier. Okay. The next item I have here is Skin and Tonic London Peppermint Lip Balm. This is one of my favourite lip balms. I was using the Laneige Sleeping Mask um, and I found my lips started to get dry using it. So I got this off Beauty Bay. There was a tin of four of them for £15. Um, so this one here works out at 3.75 for one. Um, it's natural, organic, um, sustainably sourced, British made. I have to say it, it's great. My lips I put on at night time to go to sleep, and I wake up the next morning and my lips are still moisturised. Um, I love them, so that will definitely be a repurchase. I'd just say it's one of the best lip balms I have tried. Okay, I seem to have lost a few of my empties. I did use a This Works Perfect Legs a uh, ten mil, but I do not seem to have the empty. I do not know what I've done, but I probably threw it in the bin, not not remembering. But I wrote it down when I used it. Uh, next one is the Z Skin Retinique. This is one that I got from Latest in Beauty. Uh, it's SPF 15, I think that says. It's a 15ml sample and the, it's £4.75 is how much this costs. Quite enjoyed this. Um, would I repurchase? I don't know. I quite enjoy using the Retinique. Um, oil instead, especially at night times. Um, then I used up the Ted Baker Body Souffle in Blush Pink. And this is all finished up. This is in the Project Pam. Skin is in Project Pam. So this one was £11. Then we finished up, not just me, there's I, I did give some away to the kids to a 3-in-1 blemish fighting kit in the breakout box by Patchology. This is worth £18. Um, I used up, I got a packet of these from someone and I can't remember where they came from but this is the Dr. Dennis Gross um, Daily Peel. This is the one treatment in the double sachet. This is worth £3.60 for the one. Um, quite enjoyed it. Can't say it made a massive difference. It is only just the one um, treatment. I forgot what I was saying there. Then we used up the Super Drugs Vitamin E Hydrating Mist. I do enjoy this. Um, I will repurchase it. It's £3.49 and um, it's got a nice sprayer on it. it. I do feel that it hydrates. I usually put that on before I put on my serum so then it gets locked into my skin too. i um, got a Cetaphil lotion which is 29 millilitres. I've got this in one of our boxes. Um, this is worth 55 pence. Wouldn't repurchase. Didn't enjoy it at all. Um, felt kind of greasy ish. The next one is a shampoo and conditioner I got from the Feel Unique service. This is the Rahua and it says Rainforest Grown Beauty. 
from the back from um, Beauty is Power. These are 12ml shampoo and 10ml conditioner. And um, this is worth yeah, that is right. Five pound and forty-five pence. Shampoo is, and the conditioner is very expensive from this brand. Um, and I've managed to finish up a Poe um, Brightening Eye Serum. This bottle is well dark. And it's supposed to be a pink label, but as you can see, it's um, changed colour. This took me. over a year to finish up. Um, this is Dr. Botanicals and it's worth £19. And because it's an oil, a little goes a long way. Um, I did enjoy it. I did... Would I repurchase it? I'm not sure because I'm not sure it did that much for my eyes, but I did enjoy using it. Something else that I know I've thrown out because I was away from home when I threw this out and that's the Bybee Plumper which we got in one of our boxes and it was worth £9. And um, then I used up this little Revolution 5ml um, Hyaluronic Serum and um, it's worth £1.67. Then the Declior Aroma Cleanse um, 50 mils. It's I got it in one of my boxes again. Couldn't tell you which one. This is nine pounds fifty. Then the last thing I, I used, which is something I use quite a lot of, um, this is the Cool and Soothe Migraine Patches. So when I'm having a a sore day, um. Sometimes it's down this side, sometimes it's the back, it comes right down the back of my neck. Depending on where the sorest point is, I apply these. Um, so it could be across my head, it could be down my face, it could be just on the back of my neck. Um, and I do find that these do help give me a bit of relief. Um, I've gone through four boxes of these this month, so that's eight. Uh, no, there's four in each box, so it's 16 of these. Um, so if anyone suffers from migraines or like inflammation or that, I do suggest you give these a try. I get these in pound stretchers and they are one ninety nine a box. Um, so the four boxes came to seven ninety six. Um, Pound stretchers is the cheapest place that I've found them so far, because usually they can be three fifty, so you, it's almost half price buying them in pound stretchers. So the total of my empties that I used up was twenty four um, products, and it came to a total of one hundred and ninety seven pounds and eighty three pence. I think most of that was the wipes and the foot cream that I got from FabFitFun because they are some pricey items. Um, so, so far, January and February together is 32869 is what I've used up in empties, which I have to say is quite a large total. But, yeah. If you do empties videos, let me know and I will pop over and have a watch. I do like watching empties videos. Um, I hope you all have a fantastic day and I'll catch you the next time. Bye bye now.